This is called Chrono Odyssey. This is from Magic Wagon. This particular piece sits above my fireplace on my mantle. It's very elegant. It's a piano finish, as a lot of their items are, and it's just a wonderful, wonderful collectible piece. You can see from my clock, it's about 11.37, um, and one of the routines you can do with this, I'm going to turn this towards me and away from you. If I had a, a husband and wife, let's say, here in my audience with me, I would turn to the... Um, wife, and I would ask her to select an hour in time, maybe something that means something to her, something that's personal to her. And she does. Let's say she comes up with, um, I don't know, let's say three o'clock. And then I would ask her mate to put minutes to her hours. So maybe he'll say 326. That sounds good to me. Now, again, I would have them turn it around too. And you can see the time on here is exactly 326, just as they predicted it could be. I want to show you how this works because I, I, I kind of I'm fascinated with this, and you've seen the principle done on smaller pieces before, but not quite like this. And before I receive any of the hate mail you're about to write to me for exposing something, I want you to remember that we're a magic shop. Nobody outside of their interest in magic knows the trickery exists. Nobody knows the name of this piece or that this piece is a marketed item through Magic Dealer. So please, uh, no hate mail for this. It's electronic and it works with um, a remote control. And what's neat about this, and this you can you can be you can have an assistant away, you can work it yourself in your pocket under your table, however you want to do it. Uh, the top button here turns the hands the way you're watching them turn here, and it does it rather quickly and rather quietly. Very easy to see. Now, one of the problems, inherent problems with the smaller versions is, let's say you start out here and the person says, um, let's see what time it is, I'm looking at a monitor so it's a little bit backwards. So you start out at 7 o'clock and they predict they want the time to be 6 o'clock. Well, you have to go a full rotation and talk and come up with things to say until you hit that piece. Well, if you hit the other button, you go backwards. And that's the beautiful part of this. Uh, it's half the time that any of the other watches on the market utilize, uh, meaning less patter, less stress and worry on the magician's part. Um, while the clock looks as if it keeps perfect time, if I had to say a negative, I would say that it doesn't. <laughs> you know, it, 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 it's, it's a perfect illusion. Um, because of the mechanics employed, it does not keep per, uh, time. It's not a real clock, but the illusion of, a, of it being a real clock is definitely there. The second hand that constantly rotates like this is just a perfect, perfect added feature and convincer. Again, this is from Magic Wagon. The name of the piece is Chrono Odyssey.